Excuse me, young man. Was it Coach Tucker's openness that gave you the courage to come out? Huh? Hey. Hey. Come here. Court Reynolds Lepe, I got to see you win. Congratulations. Thank you. Are you wearing makeup? Oh, well, just on my face and my ears and my neck and my hands. Okay, yeah. So listen, about this morning. Uh, Coach Tucker, no, no, Coach hey. Tucker, can we get a few words on your big win? Oh, um, I, I need to do this. Yeah, of um, course you do. Yeah, it's fine. So tell me, Coach, how does this victory feel? Well, it feels great. Obviously, I feel like the belle of the football. <laughs> Don like that when Don's laughing. It's pretty groundbreaking how the school has embraced you. Well, I'm grateful to the school, you know, and the kids and the parents. But, um, you know, I got to say, uh, I'm most grateful for, for this guy right here, my husband, uh, Mitchell, Mitchell Pritchett. Um, Hi. He's an attorney who is the voice for people without one. He is a, a real hero who doesn't get the credit he deserves. Today I went down and I watched him in the courtroom. I knew that was you. I recognized your ringtone. I'm building something. You know, yeah, I get a lot of attention, you know, coaching this game. But this man right here quietly defends the rights of real people with real problems, homeless people, forced to get jobs. No, that's not it. That's not it, but it was so close. Yes, I am standing here boldly abolishing gay stereotypes, but my makeup's running, isn't it?